the highest level of production in British Columbia ever. There's uh, 63 productions um, getting ready to go in, in BC, either through the Okanagan and Vancouver, but 63 is a is a number that uh, we've never seen before. Kelowna's Tugboat Beach was packed with film crews on Thursday as filming continued for one of the many film productions being shot here in the Okanagan. We are filming uh, a movie called Under a Lover's Moon. We're doing some, uh, some fun beach scenes today at our, our resort. There's, there's love and uh, suspense and uh, a little bit of comedy in this one, which is great. We do have uh, a lot of local crew on, on this show, which is, which is really great. Um, we have a few people today that are first time on a film set, which is wonderful. Uh, our company is kind of set to do probably 15 movies over the next year and a half. And uh, a big part of that, and for us to be successful, is to be able to hire local people and uh, contribute to the economy in the Okanagan. It's funny, I got into the film industry here. Um, I was on the last production. It was filming at my family's winery, which is in Lake Country. It's called Ex Nihilo. And we were shooting a film there and they hired me on as the liaison. So to be the point of communication between their crew um, and our staff to make sure things run smoothly. And yeah, they asked me to come aboard. So I joined the circus and here I am. Um, I love the fact that film, it's fast paced, high energy. It's just a fun environment to be a part of. Vancouver is that Hollywood North. And so it's nice to see that Kelowna is starting to become a, f a hub for the film industry as well. Because of the diminished tourist, tourist season in the Okanagan, uh, because we didn't have the smoke that we would normally have, Kelowna was the very first place in North America to have film again. The Okanagan Film Commission says the economic impact from all of these projects is about $35 million, and projects are booked well into summer 2021. For Castanet News, I'm Miriam Halpenny in Kelowna.